Hey you guys, it's Nikki and I'm back with another video. I wanted to come on here real quick and show y'all my little bit of Target stuff that I got. <laughs> y'all, because I told y'all I was going to come on here and show y'all my Target haul. Um, so let's just get right into it, y'all. <laughs> y'all, I just put in an order for um some essentials. And the first item that I had showed y'all, y'all really need to see this. <laughs> A thousand sheets, um, 12 pack of up and up toilet paper. <laughs> Y'all. <Yeah. laughs> and I really placed my order so I could get the Lumi deodorant. I wanted to show y'all. It's so little, y'all. Oh my gosh. I got the $3.99 trial size ones so I can try them out and see how they work for me. They all aluminum free, like I said. And yeah, I just wanted to try them out because Jamima on YouTube had recommended them. And if y'all don't know, she's a plus size girly. I'm a plus size girly. So I was like, if they work for her, they got to work for me. <laughs> and this is the Tangerine Clean Scent. Um, it pulls up like this. And then you roll it up. And yeah, y'all, I feel like it's working for me so far. Um, I watched a girl video and she said to put it on at night. So I had put it on at night one night and I feel like it worked better overnight. Um, I did wear it during the day at work a couple times and I was like, I don't know if it's working. <laughs> but I'm going to keep trying at it, y'all. And so these all gone and see how I feel about it. And if I feel like they work good, I'm going to get the full size. So this is the cream. I didn't even open it yet. You can see it's still got the Target tape on it. And these are the solids. All of them, tangerine, and y'all. I wanted some minis to go inside my um small Telfar shopper bag. Y'all rolling all over the place. Sorry, y'all. <laughs> um, I, the way I got y'all propped up is crazy, <laughs> but yeah. I'm trying to see what I got in here. <laughs> but y'all can see how Telfar is in the inside, and then it's like some Velcro pouches or whatever pockets in here is two on each side and i can just put these in here and they fit so good in here like i just want a whole bunch of minis to go in here and also my black girl sunscreen it's an empty really <laughs> that i ain't show y'all spf 45 to make it matte formula it fits in there real good and i found one of my mini tens of Nivea cream and I was so happy because I needed like a moisturizer y'all see how much stuff can fit in this little teeny bag <laughs> the third one fit in here I've been carrying all three of the Lumi deodorants in here tell me why I don't know why <laughs> but yeah my iPhone 11 can fit in here like people be sleeping on little bags people be saying they don't like little bags sometimes but it's okay if you don't like little bags. Like, I was a big bag girly, and I feel like when I had big bags that I would just put so much crap in there. <laughs> and I don't know, I just like the canvas, you know, the non-leather feel of this bag um, for spring and summer. Because, like I said, I'm a plus size girly, and sometimes when I was heavier, like, in the summertime, if I would carry a leather bag, yo, I would be all sweating. I would be all sweating up against the bag, and I didn't like that. So, I'm going to go with, like, canvas bags straw bags netted bags for spring and summer and yeah y'all i'm all topic for usual <laughs> but i don't really know the ingredients of these i put them in the description or something it's a whole bunch of ingredients y'all but it smells pretty good the tangerine formula the tangerine scent and what else did i get y'all i got some snacks for easter for my son and we ate them so i don't have like the Reese's, I had got the plant-based Reese's and we really liked them. Um, they didn't come with like the paper like the traditional Reese's do. They was just naked like <laughs> bare with no paper on them. But they was good and my son liked them. He's 13 years old. I wanted to get some better ingredient products for him um, because I've been reading up on like red dye number 40 and i haven't been wanting to get him that like one time he had like some reese pieces and they had red dye number 40 
and he was jumping off the walls like he'd be so hyper and stuff y'all but i got him the ghetto gastro strawberry toaster pastries we ate them but here's a little piece of the paper <laughs> that we had um this is an alternative to pop tarts it's black owned um i didn't want he was asking me for pop tarts i didn't want to get him pop tarts because the ingredients they probably got red dye number 40 as well and ghetto gastro uses your know, vegetables for their coloring of their strawberry toasted pastries it's good i think they said on the, on the packaging they had red cabbage or something but i'm gonna put the ingredients in the description box for y'all or whatever in the comments or whatever so y'all can see but y'all know my name and i like more natural things this was good y'all i'm back like I was filming and I hit my microphone and then I was watching my video and my audio had went out so I'm back <laughs> but y'all don't know I'm back because I'm gonna edit but I got the TheraBreath um, for kids anti-cavity oil rinse for my son it was $5.99 y'all it said it was on clearance <laughs> so I grabbed it but that probably ain't really you know <laughs> I don't know a real good price or whatever but it's only 10 ounces i've been using it along with my son and i just like the <laughs> i just like the um flavor of it and um yeah y'all <laughs> that's what i got from target and i was saying that um did y'all see that jessica petway died um she was a natural hair influencer and i loved watching her channel she was a christian and she had got misdiagnosed she was only 36 she had got misdiagnosed with fibroids and she really had like stage four um cancer um i could forget the cancer that she had um but um yeah hearing yeah, about her death it, it sad in me um and it is um really put things into perspective about how i need to be better about get you know be on my zoom do better about my health and this year i did hit um the out to make my health a priority 2024 i am remember i told you i was 17 pounds down and then i did gain three pounds again but yo i need to get back on my zoom <laughs> i need to be serious and people were saying that her case could have got like um done by like just a simple pap smear and i was like what it's been a long time since i had one myself and i was like at work and it was like um the medical lady was there and she was talking about how you don't really have to get a pap smear every year no more and i'm like why is they pushing it back so far like people need to get them so they can know what's going on but yeah i need to schedule mine and i'm going to schedule mine and i be being all scared about my procedures and stuff like <laughs> y'all might know my age when i tell y'all this but i just got my first mammogram and i was behind and i was all scared about getting my mammogram and it really was nothing to be scared of. Like when I went and got it, I was like, that's all they do. <laughs> and I do need to get a colonoscopy. I need to um, schedule it. And I think that's it. Yeah, when I had went back to my doctor, she was like, you need to get a mammogram. You need to get a colonoscopy. You need to get a pap smear. And so, yeah, I got the mammogram done. Now I do the colonoscopy and the pap smear. But I just say a lot to say, y'all, please, um, you know, it's really all in God's hands, you know, our health and whether we're going to live or die and stuff. So please be proactive about your health. Um, it is Autism Awareness Month um, this month as well. So I just wanted to shout out all the autistic people, all the autistic moms, you know. Y'all are loved and supported. And yeah, y'all. <laughs> I think that was all that I had said on my video. And I just pray that Jessica that way, husband, family, they get justice for like her getting misdiagnosed the way that she did. Like, it just don't make no sense. But yeah, y'all, I think that's all that I wanted to say. Happy new month. It's April. Yesterday was my mother's birthday. Shout out to the Aries ladies. I was watching this lady earlier and she was like, she an Aries. And I was like, oh, I, I understand <laughs> your vibe now because she always joking and laughing and my mother was on April Fool's Day and she had Aries and she'd be always joking and laughing and playing around so every time it's like every time I find out a content creator that I watch is an Aries lady and I like I watch Tina Marie and she had Aries too and she'd be all joking around a lot and stuff and I'm like oh I understand you now I understand your vibe <laughs> but yeah y'all I just be rambling on about nothing <laughs> 
But yeah, y'all, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'm going to see y'all in the next video. Bye, guys.